I was a king and a mystical transcender, in the unseen world I was married to a mermaid, the whole thing started when I was a child, when I was five years old my grandfather who live in the village wanted to see me. He asked my parent to take me to him, so my parent took me to the village to see my grandfather who was a traditional chief, he was one of the chief in the village, he was also the priest of ancestral god in the village of the Maniola, in this region of Maniola we worship the god Abasandos, grandfather was fat, old and blind, when we arrive in the village I stepped toward my grandfather, he began to summon the spirit of the ancestor to come in my life. He was calling the ancestor who are already dead, in this village people believe that the deads are alive, he instructed the spirit of the deads to accompany and to guide me, they were supposed to walk before and after me, then the grandfather took me behind the house. He broke a coconut and he threw its water on me while repeating words of incantation, this was the beginning of initiation. Afterward I went to primary school and after years I finished the primary school but I could not go to the secondary school because of money, in the village of Boyaki I began to live in the house of a woman, in the night when I slept I saw myself in a repetitive dream, in these repetitive dreams I was working in a forest, in the day it was normal life but in the night I was always seeing myself in a forest working for an individual. I saw myself working in the forest for someone who had the structure of my grandfather who was blind, I was living in this physical world and also the forest world in my dream, as I was living in this house I was attracted by a cultic book that I was seeing there, one day I took one of them upon which it was written, the sixth and seventh book of Moses, and while reading I got scared by the practice that I saw in the book. Then I took the book of faith Napoleon that was about Muslim witchcraft, my father was jealous because I was enjoying a good standard of life this house of this woman, one day my father came and snatched me from my boss place and took me back to my native village without providing justifying explanation for his attitude, as I began to live in the village of Mbamaka, one day I saw a lady passing, she seems desperate, she told me that there was something in her belly that she had to vomit. I gave her a pot, and when she vomited what was in her belly, I saw they were precious stones, when we went to the market we sold some of them and we got a lot of money, considering that walking with these stones were illegal in Cameroon she suggested that we pay a visit to native doctor in order to avoid the authority, the native doctor was actually a mystician, when this man saw me with his spiritual eyes he asked me if I was a native doctor or herbalist because he saw something in me. He saw a power in me, then he showed me some herbs and asked me if I knew them, I told him that I used to see these herbs in lucid dreams when I was working for my ancestor in dreams, he said to me, I will open your eyes and you will become a great man, you will become a king in the forest world, the physical world and the spiritual, the man asked me to bring a human bone, a white chicken, egg. The mystic said he will give me queen that will guide me and take care of me in everything I need, and he promised that my eyes will be opened. It was easy to get the bone around the area where people are buried, the first bone that I brought was that of a drunk man and the mystic refused it, the second bone was accepted, when I brought what was requested by the mystic, the later took me to the riverside and he broke the egg on me and washed me in a ritual, then he told me, he told me. Wherever you see a mad woman sleep with her, once you are finished I will make you a king in the spiritual world and you will be a ruler in the underworld. Initially we came here for protection and business, but I ended up deep in occultism, the whole thing was a set up against me, the devil planned everything in order to get me deeper in occultism thanks to my ancestral connection, I approached a mad woman and had sex with her. Afterward the mystic gave me an oil of purification that I was supposed to apply for seven days, then a woman would come in my dream that woman is supposed to be my queen, in one of the seven day of purification, I was sleeping at 3 pm in the day when a lady approached me, she did not look like a queen, the lady who came in my dream was frail as if she was sick, I thought she was a sick patient who came to me to complain about her sickness but that was not the case, she was the water siren. That was supposed to be my queen, she told me that she was my queen, she said to me I will come to visit you, we had conversation afterwards she disappeared, but when she came for the second time she came with great power, she was holding a red vodka, 
She told me that she came to sleep with me, but the following days she would transport me to the underworld. I was happy to hear that, but something happened while we were chatting in the street. While I was talking to this lady someone saw me talking to this lady, then Shem went to inform my wife that she has seen me talking to a lady, my wife who did not know that this lady was a spirit of water, she attacked that woman of the sea because of jealousy, she did not know that the lady was a spirit, she removed her shoes and began to hit the water mermaid on the head and there was blood because this siren got injured and was vexed, when I saw this I took my baby from my wife to protect her from the violence, the siren who was angry and bleeding began to go away, then the she turned around and made a powder appeared on her hand and she blew it on my wife and said to her, from now on you are a skeleton and your soul is coming to me in the underworld, this altercation got the mermaid Matilda angry and she went away from me because she was angry, but my wife began to suffer, three days after this incident she was complaining about her leg, I apply powder but it did not work, Later on some people came to propose me a job somewhere, I follow this people not knowing my wife condition was deadly and fatal, the following day the two leg of my wife were paralyzed, then the hand got paralyzed, then she lost her sight, all the medication I tried to use on her was not working, then I began to take her to different native doctor, I knew that the Sarah Matilda was strong, I went to one occult that shop to another in order to heal her but none of the remedy that I tried on her works, then I paid a visit to a mystic that we used to call Professor, the latter said to me, you will never outsmart and overpower the mermaid Matilda, she is extremely powerful, unless you find a greater and more powerful queen of the sea you would not be able to save your wife because Matilda is very powerful, I asked the mystic where would I find another queen, he instructed me to buy horoscope, where I saw that there were many gods, goddess and many queen, the mystic showed me a particular queen that was very powerful, in the name of Diana, the mystic told me what to do in order to connect with the siren Diana, then the mystic told me to build a shrine in my house and set up a stream between the local water and my house, when Diana appeared to me, she told me, I have seen your courage and bravery, and I like you because you are brave, then the siren instructed me to sleep with her, when we finished. I went into unconsciousness, when I opened one eye, I could see a huge python licking me from head to toe, then Diana took me to her world underwater, she said I am taking you to your throne, when we arrived I noticed that the leg and the arm of my throne were python, even the cover of the throne was snake, the book that I used was called magic power of witchcraft, thanks to this book I could travel to other planets, the book taught me how to drive astral planes and I could do astral projection through the chakra of my belly, and I became a good pilot in astral space, I could travel to India, Japan and Jerusalem thanks to three candle and magic prayer, I had become a transcender moving all over the world through astral projection, I did not need a visa, embassy, planes, I just had to enter my room and recite prayer, it was when I was doing astral journey that I understood that there is more activity in the space than on the surface, Actually apart from the space where we see planes moving there is another planet in space, another kingdom where there is a powerful authority in space ruling the firmament and the underworld, there is no neutral ground, when I arrived in the underworld the siren Diana said to me, you must give me seven strong men, who are past her, she gave me magic one that contains strong power and magnet of manipulation, inside the magic one that was a stick there were many different powder, each power had power like power of seduction, destruction, manipulation, Diana say to me, if you ever succeed in this mission of destruction, you will be promoted and crowned in a higher throne, then Diana took me to visit the underworld and its beauty, when we began to visit the city I saw the beauty of this kingdom under the sea, then we went to a place where I saw a human body part like hand, feet, finger, brain, stomach and so on. Diana explained to me that these are body part of people living on the earth that we have captured here, when a man or woman has a part of his body captured in the marine kingdom that part of his body will dysfunction on the earth, he will be sick because his member is in captivity in the marine kingdom, there are people whose heart are in prison in the water world as a result they have heart condition, there are also people whose legs are in prison, as a result they are handicapped. There are people whose kidney is problematic because their kidneys are captured and kept in the marine kingdom, 
there are people who are blind because their eyes are captured in this kingdom under water, beloved, people can claim and take by force through prayer part of their body that is stolen and put in captivity in the Aquarius world, then Diana took me to the place of musician, when we arrive in this place I came to understand that musician were homosexual, in this place I saw Baphomet face to face, the god of music, she showed me all the musician that I know, I came to understand that music is demonized, I understand that 60% of musician are homosexual and 75% of musician are occultic, when I saw Baphomet I noticed that he was always laughing while talking to the goddess Diana, during the conversation between Diana and Baphomet we visited the prison of musician where many musician were held in captivity. Baphomet showed us a musician, while Baphomet was talking he was smiling and he said, this man came to me for he wanted to become a celebrity, and I gave him no totality, I did what I was supposed to do, but he failed to comply with the agreement that he signed when he came to me, he agreed to be homosexual but he has failed to do what he promised, that is why he is here in this prison, he refused to comply, then the Queen Diana took me to food department, when we arrived there I marveled, my town cannot tell you what the enemy do to the food we eat no stone is left unturned, pray before you eat otherwise you will become a victim, for even the air we breath is used as a channel of manipulation, when we wake up we must cover ourselves with the blood of Jesus Christ, then we went to visit a place where I saw something like water changing color it was beautiful, the goddess Diana told me, these are people destiny and wealth that we had capture on the earth, Many people are poor and in hardship on the earth because the money and the destiny that God gave them has been stolen, they are suffering, if only they can come to Christ and seek God in prayer their good and wealth will be restored, the Bible say, I will restore to you the years that the swarming locust has eaten, the hopper, the destroyer, and the cutter, my great army, which I sent among you, my spiritual wife Diana took me to another place where I saw many wedding garment, Diana said to me these garments represent marriage that we have captured, many women were supposed to have good marriage but we have stolen them, many women are single on the earth because we have stolen their marriage, they may enter the marriage, but in the end they will come out, others will suffer because their original marriage have been stolen, then we went to a place where I saw many baby that are prepared for mission on the earth, demon were pounded them with charms, when people come looking for baby, at the native doctor they will get baby of the Marian kingdom who come to earth with mission, Diana showed me demons who are working owner of private hospital, clinic and pharmacy, I also saw demons who work with hairdressers in hair salon, I saw how owner of barber shop are bringing hair of their customer in the Marian kingdom, and I saw how demons are stealing people destiny, wealth and glory through their hair, there is a trade of human hair in the Marian kingdom. Many people life and destiny has been compromised through their hair by evil owner of saloon, remember God told Samson no one should touch his hair because his glory was in his hair, since I saw what demons were doing with hair of people in the water world I don't go to the barbershop, and I ever go to the barbershop I will make sure that I gather my hair, there are owner of barbershop who are wonderfully rich because of what they do with people hair. These demon work with a cultist who possess hair salon they collect human hair of the customer because it is used in the underworld, then I went to a place where I saw a handkerchief, many satanists take these handkerchief they would pay women a lot of money to sleep with them and they will wipe the genital part of the woman in order to collect their sperm and they would take it to the underworld, as a result the woman won't deliver the baby in their lives because their egg are captured by siren underworld, sometime the women would suffer stomach ache. There are also women collecting men's sperm that is in high demand in the dark of world of mermaid for genetic manipulation, sperm like that can be sold 1 million franc because all the egg are captured, the occultist and the men of power would pay a lot of money to ladies to sleep with them and they would wipe their genital part and go away with their sperm, women and men who fall victim of these practice suffer sterility, women also suffer pain in lower abdomen. On the other hand they are men suffering from lack of sperm today, the Queen Diana took to me to visit a powerful spirit in the underworld, the spirit was humanoid but he was a spider man, this spirit is a destiny, star and shadow catcher, he can run 10,000 km in one second, 
he has great speed in the astral world, if you see a Spider-Man he is a destiny catcher, they are used by the dark world to catch people destiny and chances, you can be walking in a high road, everybody will pass but when it's your turn the spider attack you because they are watching you in the mirror, many underworld agent have nursery and primary school that's where they capture children destiny, before you send your children to school you must cover them with the blood of Jesus Christ.